just had a baby, as we saw uh, in the dressing room check-in, and you had something I'd never heard of before. You have you had a safe word during labour. Yeah, yeah. I, I highly recommend the safe word. So why um, why would you have a safe word? Okay, well, I decided that I wanted to have an all-natural birth. Um, and so I, my husband and I went to a, a class to kind of learn about what, all, what would happen, because we've mm -hmm. never been in a labor before. And so um, we were, the woman was suggesting that everyone have a safe word, just in case. Because if you really want to surrender and say, okay, give me the drugs, mm -hmm. you want to be able to have like a, a final word that you can go to that will finally say, okay, now she's saying, now she, we can believe her. Because right. you can scream and, and you know, freak out all you want and say like, give me the drugs and whatever, <sighs> but you really want to get, you know, you want to have that final word. So the woman recommended um, a two part word. She said peanut butter. So then you can be like, peanut, 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 peanut. You never get to butter, and it's fine. So you don't get the drugs. So I decided to go with almond butter. <laughs> I'm not that unique, but I eat a lot of almond butter. Um, and I, it ended up uh, coming in handy. I had a three-day long labor. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. Um, but uh, so I, I tried to do it naturally. I tried really hard. Yeah. Um, and then I finally surrendered on day three. And, um, and screamed almond butter and started crying. And then that meant get me to the hospital and get me the drugs. Sure. And so um, it was the longest five minute car ride I've ever taken in my life to the hospital. <laughs> and, uh, and then I finally I got the drugs and got that and baby out. And then you got this like, beautiful baby. Well, yeah, congratulations. She's yeah. absolutely you. beautiful. Thank you. She really is. <laughs> now, Randall.